Hello and welcome to another weekly update of our cocoon bin. Something interesting happened a couple of days ago. I, ch I lifted the lid. Oh, wait, now I can't lift the lid. I lifted the lid and for the first time I saw some worms. Not many, but some. They were at at the top here about 10 I would say and this hasn't happened before so when when something like that happens you always ask yourself why um, I check the sides and it's dry the lid is dry I know it's not for lack of air because I have this large uh, cut out you can see that with the mesh fabric instead of a bunch of little holes so I know it's not the air and I don't think that there are too many worms for this particular bin this is 10 gallon and you know they are fairly fairly um, young worms so I started digging around and discovered that they they were out of food they had absolutely no food. They composted the bedding. If you look to my previous videos, you will see that. And all of this has been composted. So the poor guys were hungry, and I guess they went uh, looking for food. So what I did was I gave them a feeding a little bit earlier than planned. I want my worms to be happy and I covered the top with a lot of dry paper and cardboard. Typically worms don't like to uh, climb through dry paper or dry anything for that matter so but I did give them a corn and Let's see if they like it. It's only been, oops, is it gonna focus? Yeah. It's only been two days, so they may have not all moved into this area yet, but certainly enough of them figured it out. So they like the corn. So we're going to bury that back, back up. We will consider this. There's a, another handful of them here. You can see. Very nice. So the conditions are, are good in the bin. Uh, it's not overly moist. It's not dry at all. So it was just um, lack of food. So I'm glad I checked on them ahead of time. Just had some free time, so, so I did that. And, um, and they were a hungry bunch. So when you find uh, a situation where, you know, your worms are climbing the sides, you always ask yourself, you know, why? Because normally if they're happy and everything's okay inside the bin, they will stay inside the bin. It's not enough to just, you know, put a light on and force them back inside. If the conditions are not ideal for them, it's like torture. So I'm gonna give them just a little bit more here. Um, some of the wet, wet food. I don't want them getting hungry ahead of time. I want them to be happy. So just a little bit more. They seem to, uh, since they have um, grown, they seem to have increased their appetite. So we will 
give them what they need and what they want, which is more food. And that's it. So yeah, just a, a quick, quick little video. Never ignore your worm uh, climbing. Uh, sometimes they'll climb because of, um, you know, a pressure of you know, pressure outside. If it's if it's something changes, if the weather changes, and especially the blue worms, they'll climb um, if it's raining. But in general, other than that, other than barometric pressure, you really should consider uh, figuring out what is going on in the bin instead of just focusing a light and forcing the worms back down. And that's it for today. I think they'll be happy and there's more than enough food for them to last the rest of the week. Thanks for joining me.